In this video, you will learn how to import data from sample Excel files into Tally Prime. Whether you're new to recording data in Excel or already have your own organized Excel sheets with the import feature, you can effortlessly bring your data into Tally Prime. To start importing data into Tally Prime, all you need is an Excel file that contains a list of your masters and transactions. If you are new to recording data in Excel, don't worry. Tally Prime provides sample Excel files to help you structure your data. You can use these sample Excel files as a starting point for recording masters and transaction details without making any changes to their structure. You can add or remove columns from the sample Excel file but do not change the field names. Simply specify the source of the sample Excel file and the worksheet name that you want to import data from. First, let's see how to download the sample Excel file for masters. To access the sample files, press Alt plus O, Import. Manage. Sample Excel file. Masters. While exporting the sample Excel file for masters, the all accounting masters.xlsx file is selected by default. Let's say you want the sample Excel file for ledgers. Press C configure. As you can see, a table containing the list of configurations appears on the screen. Select ledgers under export sample file for under export settings, the file format is pre-selected as Excel spreadsheet. You can select the location where the file is getting exported. Set the folder path for exporting the file. Modify the file name to be exported if needed. Decide whether you want to open the file after export. Once you have selected all the details, press Escape. Finally, press E, Export, to export the sample Excel file. As you can see, the sample Excel file for ledgers is successfully exported. After export, make sure to read the accompanying README document for guidance. The README worksheet is to assist you in using the sample Excel file for entering data. It lists all the fields applicable for the ledgers and also indicates the mandatory fields for the masters required for the import process. Once you are clear on how to use the sample Excel file, you can enter details of the ledgers in the worksheet ledger and save the Excel file. Similarly, you can download the sample Excel file for transactions and start entering details of your transactions in the respective columns. Now, let's see how to import data using the sample Excel file. Let's consider that you have entered details of your party, bank, sales and purchase ledgers in the downloaded sample Excel file. As you can see, the sample file contains details of your ledgers. Note that you can delete the columns that do not have any data in the sample file. Similarly, you can add new column headers as needed by referring to the README worksheet. Ensure to use column headers as is from the README sheet without any change in the field names. Now let's see how to import the ledger details into Tally Prime. Press Alt plus O, Import and select Masters. The import data screen appears. Now, make sure the format and location of your Excel file are correct. Select Excel spreadsheet as the file format. The file path is prefilled with the location configured under import, configuration, location of import slash export files. Under file to import, select the sample Excel file that is ledger.xlsx. From the list of worksheets, choose the worksheet for ledger. From the list of mapping templates, select default template. Now, from the list of masters, select the type of master that you are importing. In this case, select ledger. You can configure the behavior of the import, 
concerning the existing masters in tally prime. From the list of import behaviors, select what you want to do with the existing masters. It is possible that your existing company data has the same set of masters as in the Excel file. In this situation, you can choose to Combine opening balance, the opening balance of the existing master and the imported master will be combined. Ignore duplicates, any duplicate of the existing master in Excel format will be ignored. Modify with new data, the data will be modified. Let's ignore the duplicates of any existing master. Enable the Preview Import Summary option if you want to view what will be imported based on the Excel data. Do not forget to configure the backup settings before proceeding. It's recommended to take a backup before importing. Enabling the Backup Company Data Before Import option safeguards your company data. Simply specify where you want to store the backup of your company data in the backup destination path. Press I, Import, to proceed with importing your list of parties into Tally Prime. Once the import process is complete, open the chart of accounts to view the imported masters into Tally Prime. As you can see, the ledgers are all part of your company data. You can verify the details of the ledger to ensure that the data is imported correctly from your sample Excel file. For example, drill down to open the ABC Company Limited ledger. You can see that the ledger, group, address, opening balance are all imported. Drill down from the opening balance field to see that the bill wise breakup is exactly as you had entered in the sample file for ledger. Now that you have imported the masters, let's quickly see how to import the transactions made with your parties. Let's consider that you have entered details of your transactions made with the same parties in the sample Excel file for transactions. As you can see, the sample file contains details of your receipts, payments, purchase and sales. Similar to the sample file for masters, you can delete unwanted columns or add new columns to the sample Excel file for transactions. Now, let's see how to import the transaction details into Tally Prime. Press Alt plus O, Import and select Transactions. The import data screen appears. Ensure that the file format and file path are correct. Under File to Import, select the sample Excel file that is accountingvouchers.xlsx. Since your sample file contains data for different transactions, you will need the Excel file for all accounting vouchers. From the list of worksheets, choose the worksheet for accounting voucher. From the list of mapping templates, select default template. Since you have opted for all accounting vouchers, the type of vouchers is grayed out as it is not applicable in this case. Press I, Import, to proceed with importing the transactions into Tally Prime. Once the import process is complete, open the daybook and select the period as per the transaction dates to view the imported transactions into Tally Prime. You can drill down to verify the details of the transactions as you had entered in the sample Excel file. While importing data from Excel into Tally Prime, there could be certain errors and exceptions. Say, you imported your transaction data from the sample Excel file, but the corresponding master is not available in your company data. In such situations, the imported transaction will be part of the exceptions report in Tally Prime. Let's see how to handle such exceptions. Consider that you are importing transaction details from an Excel file. As done earlier, import the data by selecting the sample Excel file for the transaction.
as you can see, Tally Prime displays that import is completed with an exception. In this case, the exception occurred as the participating Master United Traders is not available in the company data. To resolve such exceptions, press X or click Exceptions. After resolving the exception, the voucher will get imported into Tally Prime. You can resolve the exception anytime later from Alt plus O import exceptions. Similarly, if Tally Prime identifies exceptions that require alterations to existing masters or transactions, these exceptions will be logged under the event log report. This is how you can view the exceptions and errors and resolve them. As you saw, Tally Prime has streamlined the process of importing data from your Excel files with so much ease and simplicity.